presidential candidate honorable professor dr wajakoya eh, 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 this guy's popularity has grown kutoka seme ata legalize 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 marijuana eh, eh wase wamesema ni wajakoya kwanza wase wenye walikuwa undecided wajakoya <laughs> and without wasting your time i hope you enjoy this compilation alafu mtacha link ya ngoma yangu hapo ivo kwa description pia uende watch ikikubamba subscribe uko pia alafu ku subscribe content ikikubamba let's watch kwa majina mimi naitwa Wajakoya nilikuwa chokora eh uh-huh. nimekuwa watchman eh uh-huh. nimekuwa polisi eh uh-huh. nimechimba makaburi eh uh-huh. na nimemea ndevu eh uh-huh. sasa hizi mimi ni wakili eh uh-huh. somea london Overhampton University. Overhampton uh, University. Warwick University. Warwick University. University of London. University of London. University of Westminster. Hey. <laughs> Wali University Service. Eh. Uh-huh. Tayari tuendelee. Ende chama yetu inaitwa nini? Inaitwaje? Tingiza mti. Roots Party of Kenya. Roots Party. Slogan yetu ni tingisha. Tingiza mti. Kwa present utalegalize nini? Bangi. Eh. Hey. For export. For export. Ndio tulipe madeni ile wa Chinese wametuletea hapa. Lakini mtu pia for leisure hapana just for leisure export. Leisure pia itakuwa hapo lakini itakuwa minimal. Eh. Umesikia million 3.4 dollars. Nitalipa hiyo madeni na gunia karibu 50 ya bangi. Eh. Hey. Wa Chinese waondoke na waende kabisa. Hey. Watu watakuwa wanafanya kazi siku ngapi? Siku nne peke yake wapumzike waone hey. akili timamu ya kuweka hmm. production kwa waka. Yes. Let's get together. Hey. Hey. Feel alright. Yours, your man. German. Yeah. So- Meaning for every 10 shillings we have to pay back 7 shillings. And you're telling me that marijuana will sort this out. You know I'm not that stupid. Just look at me and look into my eyes, Mr. Trevor Mbeja. I am. I'm talking of legalization of the product. Once we legalize, that is going to be the position. And should you be given the mandate to legalize marijuana, that is where we are starting our point. I'm not talking of it right now. I'm talking of it after we win the elections and I become the president and my deputy becomes. But even if you legalize it, where are you going to import it to? Well, <laughs> that's a good question. I think you should also do better research. I would want to ask um umeko kiangalia pale wakati ambapo ma politicians are found in a mess. Kuna vile they go behind doors na alafu wanafanya vitu kwa kule na alafu wana they walk out scot free how are you going to deal with such cases once you become the president no you could have asked me a question on corruption and, I, and my my intentions are very clear i'm going to do what has worked in other countries i will ask kenyans whether they would like restoration of death penalty to those who have stolen from them and if they say yes then they will be tried and they will face a firing squad not necessarily a firing squad but they will be hanged because we shall have those ropes made up of uh, hemp hemp makes very strong from marijuana makes very strong uh, ropes that armies the armies use them when they're jumping out of a helicopter so we shall make some ropes and hang these people don't you think that would be quite heartless what do you mean what is heartless with somebody who has stolen from you leaving you in poverty utakotokea na human rights activists if it comes to come human rights hiyo ni wazungu ukienda Saudi Arabia ama Muslim countries wana chop off one hand ukitembea hivi kama sign ya mwizi mwizi si mwizi wengine wanasema kazi ni kazi lakini kazi ya wizi ni nini mwizi huwa na nyongo alikuwa kinyongo zamani si ndio ulikuwa unaona wizi ikiendelea Kenya has reached the stage where some people especially those who have stolen from Kenyans if they are found guilty what sentence do you want to give them life imprisonment so that they keep on eating our food taxpayers money let them die If Kenyans decide that these people should be hanged, who am I? And I'm sure 90% of Kenyans will say yes because they have had enough since um <laughs> colonial days. Stealing and owning junks of land in this country, stealing and owning everything. What about the majority of Kenyans? Are they going just to languish in poverty? Look at the youth today. Do they have employment? Look at what's going on today. Eh? The youth are now being used. Youth are now being used for political purposes. Then after that they're dumped to do what that's why i want to grow marijuana for them not for smoking but for export because if a bag of marijuana sack of marijuana can give us 3.4 million dollars 100 is enough to pay off the chinese debt na waende kabisa wakwende huko we have young engineers from nairobi university civil engineers from kenyatta university kenya army brigade on engineering 
who can do this work mchainis anatoka huko anakuja hapa hajui hata kiluya eh ajui kisheng eh kazi yake ni eh konichiwa come on alafu yeye ndio nyapara wa engineering students from Nairobi University mahali ya kuchimba mtaro na kamevaa kofia kamegeti pale akawezi kuongea kizungu but again about peace rasta man is a peaceful man so we are telling leaders that if kenyans so for example huyu anafanya nini huyu huyu anafanya nini huyu wewe kijana eh wewe ni unafanya hapo unanijua wewe ni nani unanijua vizuri wewe ni unye unanijua wewe ni raho mtu wangu unanijua vizuri unanitishia unajua naweza kuja na silaha check you mimi hata niko very sure wewe uwezi kwa ruto so uwezi ni grab my friend senji bebe mpaka hiyo gari ulete ongea unanijua vizuri unanijua unajua unafaa kuwa unatoroka eh kimbia uende kimbia uende wamechosha watu sana wametochosha leo mpatie adabu bebe ni nini eh piga yeye piga hii kitu chini upige mtu una bahati bebe utaniweka kwa shida sasa aje utaniweka kwa shida kwa sababu gani mtaua Tawua. kwa nini si ni makosa kuna vitu kuna vitu sifai kufanya mbele yako sifai kuwa